Shout out to D Green with this man. Hey. <laughs> Jordan was like, get away from me, you lame ass nigga. The Mavericks being up 2-0 on the Timberwolves makes this video 10 times funnier, bruh. And on top of that, Cat got benched and Luca made him cry. Luca is out here making grown men cry. Luca got that dog in him, bro. I don't know what's going on with Anthony Edwards this series, bro. Bro, why does nobody like Carl Anthony Towns? They said, I can't stand this lame ass nigga. Ain't nobody salute you, bro. <laughs> Bro, Timberwolves fans, y'all can't even get mad at this one, bro. Y'all know Cat be doing some corny ass shit, bro. I never looked at him the same ever since he got choked out by Ben Simmons. Cat was getting choked out way before Rudy Gobert. Now, I respect Carl Anthony Towns' game, bro. He's a big man that can shoot, but he be doing some corny shit. And I guess this is why Jordan doesn't fuck with him either. He be doing a lot of zesty shit, bro. Now, I don't know if this is just him being Dominican or what, but bro. Do y'all think the Timberwolves have a chance? Now, we all know if they lose game three, it's GG's. Anthony Edwards is gonna have to be way more aggressive, bro. And Cat, you need to stop being so soft and shooting so many threes, bro. Remind you, you're fucking 7 3, bro. Anthony Edwards, you're not a shooter, bro. Go downhill and be aggressive all game. Every time that you're shooting threes, Anthony Edwards, you're bailing out the defense, bro. Stay on their neck all game long. But Donna Kick is not playing with you niggas, bro. He completely sauced the fuck out of Rudy Gobert. This is y'all defensive player of the year? I told y'all as soon as he got this reward, he did not deserve it. Overrated ass player. Bro, on God, I called that he was going to do a step back three, bro. That's fucking barbecue chicken, bro. I would have scored on Rudy Gobert in this situation. Y'all niggas really relied on Rudy Gobert on defense, bro. Getting ISO'd. Like, imagine. Whoever the Timberwolves coaches, that nigga's gonna get fired, bro. No way he's gonna have a job next season, bro. Nas Reed had the game of his life, bro. Nigga made like seven out of eight threes. Something crazy like that. The only three I seen him miss was the one to win the game. Bro, I picked the Timberwolves to win, but Kyrie is literally my favorite point guard of probably all time, bro. Like, honestly, I really could give a fuck who wins because LeBron is on his couch right now not playing, but... But I thought the Timberwolves were gonna be up 2-0, not the Mavericks. Y'all are actually letting Luka and Kyrie drop 30 balls? These are the only guys that are not supposed to score. And y'all are letting them score. Defensive player of the year, my ass, bro. Luka completely bitch Rudy Gober, bro. Go home, bitch. You can't fucking guard me, bitch. And this is not Rudy Gobert's first time getting cooked by Luca. Plus of Greece had 46 and 45 points. Berkowitz from Israel. Here we go. And another three. But can y'all imagine a Kyrie against the Celtics in the finals? Y'all know the history that Kyrie and Boston has, bro. They're going to be saying the most racist shit of all time. 
if Kyrie goes back to the finals against the Celtics. And Luka against Tatum? Remind you, these are also two Jordan Brand athletes going against each other. Because, I mean, let's face it. The Celtics are going to be in the finals. That series been over. I mean, I think everybody knew the Celtics were going to be in the finals like halfway through the season, bro. The Eastern Conference has absolutely no fucking talent. But the Celtics versus the Mavs in the finals, that'd be a generational matchup. I can't even lie, bro. And I guess that's exactly how the NBA scripted it to be. Nobody's seen the Mavericks making the finals? Let's be realistic. Unless you are a Mavericks fan, nobody picked the Mavericks to be in the finals. Let's just be honest for a second. I honestly thought they were going to get bounced out by the Clippers. And then they defeated the number one seed, Shea Gidgeous and shit hologram. Bro, this is a generational run by Luka and Kyrie, bro. Nobody questioned that they could score the basketball, but now they have Gafford and Lively, the Twin Towers. Bro, nobody seen this coming. No diddy. But the series is not over yet. So subscribe to D Green and stay tuned. It's a parade inside my city. No, 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 it's not, my nigga. It's definitely not a parade inside your city.